hello everyone welcome back to my channel and today i have a tutorial about Elast adobe illustrator and would like to show you how to make a tech effect that um today we will do some techniques that you all guy may know or not know already but um however i still want to share and um in the video today i will show you how to make the text effect like um, you can see in the thumbnail and you will start doing it together okay so i hope you can follow along and can do it by your own okay so we will get started with the uh, opening the illustrator so we will do this okay idea the idea will make this happen and uh, we will start from the beginning together okay so right now um we have to choose two colors that we want so here we have the blue and one is the light blue okay so we have to make those two so we have to select the color that we want first so now we can draw the square two square and uh, i will fill this with um, the color that i want or i can choose it from here we will choose this slide one and we can copy this by press the V sorry not that V and hold the alt and drag it there to make a duplication to duplicate it and we will fill this with another color like this dark okay so we'll like have this color and the blue one okay now um we will start making the background so we will select the dark color one to make it as the background so we will start drawing the square to make our background here okay so it is dark so we have to lock our background by pressing control and number two okay so it lock okay so right now we continue with inserting um text in order to write 2020 we don't have to write all of them yeah two two here and zero two zero as well so we don't have to write them all and make them one by one so uh, we have to make only one two and one zero so we duplicate the, both of them and we will have them like this so we don't waste our time making uh, many many uh, layer unless you want a different uh, style or another text but right now we just make these two uh, different so we jump to our practice and we start with the text okay so now i will make the text uh, bigger and i will tell you which font i use okay so I will put the uh, say two first and um I will choose the font. I have downloaded the uh, font name UK number plate this one. Okay. So we make it bigger like this. And we have to fill it with the primary color here. Uh, we have to select this to copy the 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 RGB value the hash sorry okay and the fill here we have to paste it and we have this thing over here and okay and we can duplicate it and make a zero one okay by control c and control f okay so we can have this two here okay so i have to put it here and i will uh, adjust it to zero so we have the different this so it it make it uh, the same width and height so we don't make it one is big one is small so okay just go to layer layer and uh, expand it down and we try to um, duplicate the the this layer okay so by doing the same thing control c and control f Okay, so we have this two layer and we hide the background one, the lower one. So we work on the top one. 
right now um, we have to select where we want to make the gradient okay we continue with making this as the outline by selecting the layer and go to type and create outline okay, it has now it is outline so we duplicate it by using uh, Control C and Control F. So we have two layer here. So we have to hide one, the lower one, and we work on the top one. Okay. So now we have to select which area we need to make the gradient. So we will use the pen tool. You can click on P or right it over here. Okay. So ideally, I will make the the top part here to be uh, gradient. So this, I will start with this. Okay, like this. You can hold it to make it straight. Hold shift, sorry. And do this and hold shift again and hold shift again. We come here a bit further and do this so we have this so we have to select both the this the new layer the, uh, the selection and the layer number two by holding save and so we have the selection of two, two layer and we will find the part in the in the uh, window part finder so i have already in here so i will click this like intersect so we have this thing we make this to be gradient by using the two color that we have selected before so in gradient tool here we have to make to select this the middle one okay and the first uh the angle we need to select the like this minus 90 degree in the first color we will use this color Okay, this one. So we copy this, copy, and come back here. And we change this to, have to choose the RGB, and we pay this volume like that. Press enter. So we have the top color like that, and the second color, we have to like um, do the same thing. Copy this first copy this and okay we we'll come back here and double click we we'll choose this and we paste it in boom okay so you can see it's like this so now we can so read the lower layer so it display like this okay now we finish with the number two so we will work on the zero okay so zero we'll move it close or we'll move it later okay this will be easy i will make it easy for you okay now we will make this part we will check this okay we do this okay we will make this part to be um, gradient so we will uh, okay. Don't forget to make it outline to make the outline of this by going to type and um, get outlined. So we have the zero as the outline. So we have to duplicate it. Control C and Control F. Okay. So we got the two layer. Can move this down to be together and this two together. Okay. So we hide one and we start selecting the area that we want to work on. And hold shift to get here, shift to get here, shift to get here and finish it there. Okay, so same with the number two, we select it and hold shift also like the zero so we have this 
so we use the pathfinder and we intersect so we got this now we'll apply the same uh, gradient that we had before so this one okay this time we will just it uh, like this um, 90 degree so make the top one darker and we use the color so first we select the color here copy it and go to uh, gradient and select and no this one okay yes and select this OGB do it like that and one more thing copy this code and come back to do it like this mm -hmm. paste it in enter so okay so we got this and we have to show the zero here okay so we can see that this part is a bit like cut out or it's not really um, we we want this color to be the same so we have to adjust um, the slider here to make it like that so more i think go more okay uh, go more or we can even do this Okay, this is one color and there's that the cutter okay so uh, we will do it's on another part it's right here so we select it and control C control F it and move it there okay we will uh, rotate it like that At this time we will move it there so we will try to adjust it as much as we can to make it look great if you have time you can try to do it your own but right now it's a uh, it's okay for me so select this and move it closer like that and then you can uh, control C and control F for both of them to create a complete 2020 like that or even a bit further okay okay that's it for the tutorial today like I told you before if you have any question or anything that you are not sure and you want to make it clear you can comment down below in the comment section and i will try to reply to you so that's it for the tutorial today and thank you for watching and please if you like this video please give it a thumb up and want to get more video please subscribe to my channel thank you for watching see you in the next one